Well, welcome back, everybody. We're not looking too bad out there this evening. It's right here is Laurel Ford. We're taking a live look at the city. Beautiful. Currently, they're sitting at 94 degrees. Traffic pretty smooth there on Highway 15 on the north side of town this evening. Now we'll head down the road to Ellisville Jones College. 94 degrees. You can tell it's a beautiful evening out there. You got the, the uh, what is it? Golden hour light right there shining on all the buildings. A beautiful evening sitting up here across South Mississippi, but it's still hot. We're still in the 90s. 94 degrees right Right now in Moselle, 94 in Hattiesburg. It's also 94 in Purvis. And look at Columbia sitting at 95 degrees. Collins at 97. So again, it does not feel like September. It feels more like August out there, but at least it's not 100. Take the win where you can find it, folks. That's what I always say. Temperatures for the rest of this evening will eventually fall back down into the 80s once the sun sets here in just a little bit. Skies are going to be partly cloudy as we go into tonight. Now, tomorrow, there is going to be a small chance of a shower. I'll say this. Just take an umbrella just in case. It's not going to be a complete washout by any stretch of the imagination, 30%, but it is something uh, that we'll keep an eye on. So let's show you how this pans out. Tomorrow we wake up with temperatures into the 70s. We'll see a few clouds as we go into the day. We're going to see more clouds into the afternoon. Skies are going to be mostly cloudy. Temperatures making it up into the upper 80s, eventually near 90 degrees. And here come those pop up showers into the afternoon. Again, not everybody gets in on the action. Not everybody gets a dousing of rain, but it is going to be out there nonetheless. So just keep an eye to the sky. And of course, that WDM 7 first alert weather app will be able to track them with you uh, as you go throughout your day. Then those rain chances will go away by Thursday. And we're going to actually see our temperatures dip down a little bit. So we're going to go from 97 today to 90 on Thursday, 91 Friday. A few spotty showers return by the weekend, mainly for Saturday. Temperatures right around 90 degrees Saturday. The reason we're going to see a cold, well, a cold front coming through here. You know what I'm talking about, folks. It's going to be a slight cool, but it ain't going to be really much. So that front comes through Saturday. It gives us those hit or miss showers. And then as we go through Sunday, we dry out and we'll get a little bit of a reinforcing shot on Monday. Some indications that we may get some lower humidity in here to start off next week. So keep your fingers crossed for that. The humidity has been the, probably the roughest thing that we've been experiencing over the last several days. Looking ahead to the next seven days, you'll notice Sunday, once that front passes through, temperatures cool down, 89 degrees. That could be the first 80 uh, in our area without rain, without basically what I'm saying is it's not raining outside causing that 80 degrees uh, that we've experienced in a very long time. I actually have to go back on the record book and look at that. Next week, temperatures basically stay into the low 90s. And as we extend that into the next 10 days, you'll notice those temperatures not really warming up that much. They'll remain into the mid 90s through much of next week. All right, Patrick, thanks for the battle for the bell returns to Hattiesburg this weekend. We're going to get you ready for Southern Miss against Tulane after the break.